slow down even Texans bat speed though. So that was a good team win. AJ gave us what we needed off the mound to start. You know, he had to battle for the day. And uh, we were just we were one run better than him at the end of the day. You know, everybody threw in something. Obviously Andrew threw in a bunch. And the guy in front of him getting on a couple times, Josh, that made a world of difference as well. Why do teams continue to pitch to Andrew? I mean you would think they would, you know, you know Rob, we touched on this about a week ago. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, some of it, I just think they think they can get him out. The guy that day thinks he can get him out. And that's about all I got for you. They think they can get him out. <laughs> Even after the first home run Smiley gave, he's still... Well, you know, but he base is loaded. You get him to fly out, and then you think, okay, I'd get him out there. And, well, he put a little better swing on a ball out there, and he rode it over the field rather than flying out. But... I mean, there's something to be said for also not missing pitches that he might have been missing before. The ball in the zone now, he's squaring it up. And I think he'd probably even tell you that he's missed a lot of balls that he should have hit. So when you start flushing those balls, then you hear the talk goes the other way. Why do you pitch? Why don't they back him up? All these things come into play. And yeah, they all, they all have a, you know quality and value to what they're saying. But the point being, at the end of the day, that guy in the mound, if he thinks he can get him out, he's going to try and make some pitches.